Hello guys, so um, this is my very first video, I've been thinking about uh, starting a new series, and I'm gonna be playing Pokemon Emerald Randomizer, Nuzlocke. Now, I have played a little through the game, I hope that doesn't mind, but basically I'm gonna run into everything, so right now I'm in, I'm in Petalburg Woods, but I've already beaten three gyms, and I was just heading up to beat Flannery. Okay, so now I'm going to go back and um, to Petalbrook City and show you my Pokemon, my PC. Okay, so we're in Petalbrook City, now, but I, I, I have already... We can read it, I already said that. Okay, so now I'm gonna go into the Pokest into the Pokemon Center and go over here. To show you guys my and here are my Pokemon. Okay, so first let's show you my party Pokemon. We have Horsey the Horsey, Tangi the Tangela, Wari the Warrain. T Typhy the Typhlosion, Mooney the Lunatone, Sealy mm, the Seal, and I'm gonna show you the guys that Pokemon I have in my boxes. We have Cloisy the Cloister, Lapri the Lapras, Mewy the Mew, Beldy the Beldum, Jury the Jurachi, Hitty the Hitmonchan, Chari the Charmeleon, SP the Espion a, He who mustn't be named Sizzy the Scissor Septi the Septile Vibri the Vibrava Hunty the Huntail Mary the Marowak Tyree the Tyranitar Pori the Porygon Niney the Ninetales Nitty the Nidorino Army the Armado Cab Cabby the Kabutops, Ditty the Ditto, Sherry the Shedinja, Ivy the Ivysaur, Swampy the Swampert, Sally the Salamence, Rayquai the Rayquaza, KD the, Ka the Kadabra, Ami the Ammonite, Treaky the Trico, Quilly the Quilava, and Ludi the the Ludicolo, Nidhi the Nidoran, male, and Seeky the Sea King. Now, I have to mention, because it's a Nuzlocke, and I'm keeping some of the rules of the actual Nuzlocke, every Pokemon that faints, it dies. So, um, here is my cemetery. Now, since I don't have any actual footage of how they died, because, well, I never actually filmed it, there are four Pokemon that died. Wheezy the Weezing, Cleffy the Cleffa, Polly the Poliwhirl, and Baby Polly the Poliwag. So, because again, I haven't filmed it, I feel it is my duty to tell you the story of how they died. Wheezy was killed in Granite Cave by a Sceptile, where I caught Septi. And then Cleffy, Polly, and Baby Polly actually all died for one for the same reason. You see, they all had a sleeping move, and I was trying to catch a Reggie Steel. Except Reggie Steels are annoying, and and almost all they know is at low levels like the ones I'm I'm avail I'm avail I'm open to. They know explosion, and they tend to use explosion a lot. And yeah, that and because they have. Because of how powerful explosion is, well, first of all, a Cleffa and a Poliwag aren't really surviving an explosion, and also Polly, the Poliwhirl, Polly the Poliwhirl, he was sort of under leveled against the Poliwag that that murdered, that killed him. So yeah, that explains it. Also, guys, so and the thing is, I have added some extra. How should I put this? Oh yes, extra rules to the rules. Lock. I hope that doesn't change your view. Mm. As first one, if I encounter any starter Pokemon, I'm available to catch them because 
This is due to a grudge I always had when seeing, I always have been seeing other people at the start of Pokemon that I never got to. And also, same goes for legend, for any legendary I encounter. That's that's why I have a lot of these Pokemon. Also, uh, the, also another question that that might come up is like, why do I have so many Pokemon? It's a Nels. I can only get one per route. Well, first of all, uh, I don't. It's not the first Pokemon I encounter because it's my first Nuzzle. Nuzlocke, so I don't, I don't want it to be super hard for me. Of course, I promise I will do an, uh, a real one at some point. And um, and so, actually, the, uh, there's a story behind. On run route, I actually caught Nidhi, Army, and Ka and Cabby. Now, the reason behind this is, again, the story with the Registeer. So, basically, um, uh, when, when arriving... Mm, on the route just below Slateport City, uh, there was a f obviously you can fish there, and I fished, and now I found where Charmeleons, which I already had from Petalburg City, so I wasn't able to catch any. And then in pe in actual Slateport City, there were only two Pokemon available for fishing: Ninety the Nine Tails, and I was thinking about getting the other one, which is Registeel, but nope, that one is stupidly annoying to catch. So I decided on the next route. To catch an extra one. So, uh, also, another thing I want to add is um, notice some of the names like Cloisty the Cloister, Char the Charmeleon, Espedespion, and Kiho must soon to be named. Tyre the Tyranitar, Ditty the Ditto, Cabby the Kabutas. You get the idea. I'm not the best at choosing names. So that's why I decided if you guys can. Right, and if you guys are interested, you can write in the comments the name, the nick, uh, what nickname should I, I should give for one Pokemon, one Pokemon, so that I make it fair for everyone who wants to write down. Uh, but um, after after a little a little bit of time, if I see that only some people have written and not really. It not not for everyone. I'll 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 write that you can also nickname what other Pokemon haven't been given nicknames. See, I'm kind of bad at coming up with nicknames. So yeah. Um, now, uh, this is just now. This is just, again. This is just an an introduction video. Really, I'm not gonna uh, like actual present actual footage of me playing the game this is to basically just introduce you to the game uh to me and my team members i'm a, now a th I, I should also tell you how i got these pokemon in my team in the first place so mooney uh he was my starter my other choices were a marrow and a Layron. and while marrow is he can evolve at a reasonably early level at 17 I didn't think Azumarill was the best choice. Now, I mean, I, I know I don't know if, if that I was correct, but then again, I have met a couple of Azumarill, so they're not that rare. And then later on, I had to get him up from level five to forty-two, which there's no there's no hell way I'm doing that. And so yeah. Oh yeah, and then we have Tangy the Tangela. He was very hard to catch. I had to use a Great Ball on him. Wari and Typhi, and yeah, don't don't ask me how I caught this with a normal, regular Pokeball. I just somehow was able to. Oh yeah, and and then I have Sealy the Seal, who I actually caught on one route instead of a Celebi. Again, it was very hard. So, so um, okay, guys, uh, I think that's gonna wrap it up for now. I hope you enjoyed, and uh, again, leave a comment down below of which of these Pokemon uh, you want to nickname. I accept any nicknames as long as they're, you know, inappropriate. Not like a he who mustn't be named again. Okay, that's gonna wrap it up for now, guys. Bye!